Welcome back to another video on the channel. Hopefully you guys are having a great day. So I finally unlocked the Karambit knife in Modern Warfare 3. And there's a couple different ways that you can unlock this weapon through zombies, multiplayer, as well as like, you know, a really easy way through zombies. And that's if you have a friend that already has it unlocked, just get him to drop it for you and then just instantly go and exfil and then you'll have the weapon unlocked. But of course, I didn't have a friend that had it unlocked, so I had to do it the hard way, which was do all of my daily challenges in zombies because it actually tracks in zombies and multiplayer just doesn't for some reason. Then go and spend like three hours doing contracts to then unlock it. I think the armory system is just so dumb but when you compare the karambit knife to the gutter knife there is some differences when it comes to their statistics the gutter knife is going to give you more lunge or range and then the karambit is going to give you more mobility i'll be completely honest with you guys i don't think it's that noticeable maybe it'll come into effect in search and destroy where things matter a little bit more than respawn i just feel like respawn i just run around like a chicken with my head cut off but in search and destroy could definitely matter but overall i don't really see a huge difference in the two but yes ended up messing around with it for a good couple games today got a really crazy streak and on top of that had the reactions flowing you guys should definitely end up enjoying it. if you do as always man make sure you drop a like down below as well as if you are new around here and you do to be enjoying the content, I'd really appreciate if you drop me a sub. It's completely free and you can change your mind whenever you want to. Anyways, without further ado, let's go and hop into the gameplay. I just finished up grinding some zombies and just grinding out those contracts and I finally unlocked the Karambit knife. So I'm excited to mess around with it in game. I know you can exfil with it, which I probably talked about in the intro, but let's go and check out this inspect here, man. That's pretty sick. You gotta love it. This is the first time we've ever had a Karambit knife in Call of Duty, I believe. That's a super long inspect. Dude, relax, bro. You gotta relax. You're dead. God, those guys need to chill, man. I'm just trying to inspect my Karambit knife. And they're over here spawn killing me, bro. Like, just let me inspect this thing. It actually looks really cool. It's a really long inspect. See, dude, everybody's just trying to ruin my time inspecting this Karambit knife for some reason. I don't know what's wrong with people. People are just weird. And I'm, okay. Whatever, I I'll inspect the next game. Clearly this game, they're not going to let me inspect it. In peace, at least. Oh, yeah, you're executed, buddy. Yes, yeah, sir. Okay. Oh, destroyed. Oh. Got him. Oh, my God. It feels weird using this Karambit knife compared to the gutter knife. It just feels a little different. Not that I was expecting it to feel the same. I just, I didn't think it was going to feel like as different as this feels. This is about the best map we could have got in order to check this out, though. Love me some favela, bro not happening the only differences between the two melees is that the karambit has faster mobility and a little bit less range or lunge so there's not many differences when it comes to these melees and it's not that significantly different in general oh we're on a 10 kill streak okay got you I'm trying to get this advanced man we're one kill off of this advanced that'll help us out a lot when it comes to streaking yes sir we got it let's go come here buddy I'm not even messing with my throwing knives right now. I'm just trying to get these Karambit kills flowing. Grenade. Oh, throw a grenade. Got him. Oh, we're on a 15, baby. This is about the best first game I could have asked for with this. I'll take the free AFK. Oh, I'm dead. Mm, get me out of there. I'm just, I'm running. I'm surprised I didn't die there. Gosh, these weapons still go fast as hell in this game. Slow them down a little bit, man. Let me catch up with my knife, all right? I'm just sitting here casually inspecting it. I feel like I finally have a little bit of peace. Yes, I love it. Are you? Oh, that one just not bad. You as well. Oh, there's another one there. Oh my God, he's got a melee. I'm on a 20. Oh, stabbed him. Oh, no. Holy shit. Oh, that was close. Runner brutal. Are you? No. That was so close. Come here. No, I. What was I on, guys? What the? That's crazy, dude. I think I died on like a 28 or a 29. 
first game using the karambit knife i almost dropped a nuke that's crazy guys drop a like on this video i couldn't have asked for a better game using this honestly and that was all with the karambit knife maybe one throwing knife kill if that but i don't even think i got hardly any throwing knife kills going straight karambit kills that's that's wild oh yeah executed burger skin too the burger king skin oh that was nasty oh uh, i went for back to backs but it didn't work oh yeah Another one right here, too. What a game, dude. We were popping off that game. I still can't believe I choked the nuke, man. That had to have been like a... T it was between a 27 and a 29. I just want to let you know, these knives only, I need you to know that you are literally the weirdest person I've ever met in my life before. <laughs> that is perfect. Oh, my God, dude. That was perfect. Hey, we got Favela again. I'm not complaining. This is the best map aside... Well... I think it is the best map in this game when it comes to knifing. Then it's Karachi. Then you have other maps like Rundown and, uh, you know, Scrapyard that are solid for knifing. Not great, but like solid. They work, you know what I mean? I promise this whole video is not just going to be Favela gameplay, but when I get Favela, I like taking advantage of it because it's a really good map for knifing. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. I am too. I still three piece. I don't like the kill feed though, man. I don't like how the melee weapon looks like that. Definitely not my favorite. Oh, fucking oh my god he called me the hard r bro got him <laughs> oh i was gonna land down on him and execute him but i couldn't do it you get over here brother oh yeah wow oh dude i'm cooking this game if it's favela it's just gonna happen man i'm just gonna be cooking no way Gotcha, buddy. I just got knifed. Oh, yeah. Oh, we're on a 10 kill streak. There's a dude down here. Yep, I knew it. Oh, I hit him. Let's go. Oh, yeah. This dude. Took him out. Oh, no. Oh, I need to get. I was trying to get inside and I completely lost where I was. Oh, yeah. Oh dang! Unfortunately, traded there. You, dude. <laughs> oh, I was gonna execute him. Dang it! I keep forgetting to put my uh, field upgrade down. I don't have dead silence unlocked yet. I need to go and do that. But that's like, and that's insane. How many you have to get for dead silence? It's almost like not worth it, dude. That's like eight daily challenges. That's at least three hours of grinding uh, contracts and zombies. At least. Oh, this oh my God, bro. Holy shit. Yo. Oh my god, dude. Okay, what a bank shot. Oh. Holy sh Wait. How did that I say how did that miss? That was like right on the guy. <laughs> None of them have over 10 kills, bro. <laughs> oh, they gotta be so frustrated with me. I gotta film this in-game chat is gonna be extraordinarily toxic, dude. I think I was the final knife. GG's boys, it was fun slicing all up. Dude, get a life, bro. You first, bro. You're on the same game I'm on. You are 42. The game just dropped. You yeah, bro. You didn't swim to New Zealand? <laughs> Do you have a job yet? <laughs> nah, bro. I just got done swimming to New Zealand. Yet? You gonna go positive yet? Don't think so. That's what those little dumbasses do, bro. They just sit there and they do that little mob mentality and laugh at each other's jokes. They're just mad because they're racist little shits and they got destroyed that game. It just is what it is, bro. And that's why you don't pass up on a favela game even though you just played it. Favela is god tier for knifing. All right, so just peeping the progress I've made. I'm at 31 out of 50 kills on the Karambit knife and then we can move on to gold camo. This is gonna be for the dark vision camo. Now something I just noticed is the challenge for the Karambit knife to unlock forge is different than the gutter knife. It's get 20 kills without the enemy damaging you while using the knife. And then the gutter knife is getting five bloodthirsties, which is five, five kill streaks. But the gilded camo challenge is the exact same for both. Very interesting. Well, this is like my second game playing D-Row. The other one, I backed out. This one, 
I may end up backing out as well. I enjoy derail for a search and destroy map. It's always been pretty solid for SD. But for respawn, I feel like a lot of these Modern Warfare 2 maps just don't work for respawn. You need to be playing either ground war or search and destroy on them. That's the only way that they're enjoyable. But I did put the ghoulie camo on the Karambit knife. I just wanted to check it out real quick with the camo on there. You can barely see it because it's flipping around so fast. There we go a good chance to check it out right there the inspect on this weapon is up there when it comes to time it's up there along with the uh the commas i feel like a lot of people i've seen people talk about the karambit knife and some people like it obviously but i have seen some people talk about it and, and look at it and say like man it sucks it's nowhere near as good as like a uh a csgo did he just hit me in the head with a trip mine like that that was crazy yeah a lot of people are just saying that it's not cool it's, it's not that good because it's not as good as counter-strike knives i mean to be fair like i didn't expect it to be as good so i'm not really disappointed when it comes to the knife got him i figured it would be mid and I, i'd say it's mid in terms of looks but i think the knife and the inspect in general the overall weapon is dope to have in cod because we haven't had a weapon like this ever in cod so it's definitely nice to have something like this but at the end of the day like i'm not gonna sit here and complain about it not being as good as counter-strike karambit knives like i don't care that much and if you care that much then you probably need to just sit back look at yourself and just relax because it ain't that serious bro it's really not Gotcha, buddy. Oh, and I'm dead. Yeah, people just camp in that back building on this map. That's usually why I just back out. There's just not enough kills to go around. And it gets boring. Got you. There's one up top right here. Oh, he's got a trip mine. He's still there. He's still up here. And you're executed, buddy. That's why you don't camp up here, man. Come on. He's trying to go back and camp in the same spot, bro. No, you're not going to do it, man stop it stop camping oh this dude's trying to go back to the same spot again i'm just vibing over here making sure he doesn't get back in the same spot destroyed <laughs> why he laughed like that oh i got the 50 kills done okay i was in a whole damn little war with this guy in here i got him again bro they keep like spawning over here he wants to get in there and camp so hard i'm just holding it down so he doesn't <laughs> got him he keeps trying to get in here bro i'm on a 10 kill streak i don't care brother i'm holding this thing down One's right here. Got him. Oh, oh, I can't. I can't go that way. Get me out of here. I think teammate kind of saved me. Got him again. No. Oh, dang it. I don't like being that guy and sitting in a building the whole game. But if somebody else is going to sit there and go for the building nonstop, I'm going to do the exact same thing, bro. Like, I'm not going to sit here and let this guy, Dick Meister, get in there and absolutely obliterate me because he wants to camp. I'm going to out camp his ass. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. And still really utilize the riot shield, bro. Oh, yeah. While he's laying down, I got to do it. <laughs> we made him do a split. I made that man do a split. Nobody's going to see me. Okay. They're definitely going to see me. Nope. They're both right up here. No. Damn it. He, he knew where I was going to go. It's just crazy that I'm sitting here trying my hardest to out camp them on derail in 2023. This is a camper's wet dream map from back in the day. Are you. Oh, yeah. You're executed, buddy. Got another one flowing. This game literally went the distance as well. Kind of crazy to think about. But then again, it's derail. So, I mean, it's not kind of crazy at the same time. Oh, my God. GG's, fellas. I had to out camp your asses in there. Yes, sir. We are. Hey, bro, that wasn't nice. Oh, oh, read my bro. name. Oh, read my name. God, people are just mean as hell today for no reason, bro. Like, relax. All right, that's going to do it. Hopefully, you guys ended up enjoying it. I messed around with the cram knife a good bit today. We finally got it unlocked. It was kind of annoying getting it unlocked, but we did it. I'm not sure which melee weapon's better right now. The gutter knife and the cram are so similar that it's kind of hard to distinguish. Maybe once I start playing a good amount of search and destroy, I can really tell you guys which one's better. But as of right now, I don't think you can go wrong with using either or. Yeah, it's going to do it. I'll catch you guys on the next one, man. Peace out.